Well, this vacant lawn out here in Price Hill, it was a totally different scene here last night. The grass and weeds all overgrown, but some neighbors hope that by keeping the grass in order, that it can keep the kids cutting it in order too. The work isn't easy. This is hard work. We'd be out here about three to four hours every Saturday. Cutting, weed whacking, and sweeping. Nothing in life is going to be easy. But it's better than the alternative. They being killed off so quickly, quickly and easily. Every Saturday, nearly two dozen teens in Price Hill come out to clean up the neighborhood, working in vacant and overgrown lots. It's part of a summer jobs program that's run by volunteers. The organizers raise funds throughout the year, and each kid is given a stipend for their work. If we can turn one of these kids around, put them on the right path, then we've accomplished our goal. Bob Greenlee has been volunteering since 2015, but the program was started back in 2012 by neighborhood advocate Patty Hogan. The goal, to teach these kids another way. Responsibility, leadership. And work ethic, keeping them away from crime while also giving back to their neighborhood. Especially for the community, like I said, Price Hill, it, it helped me accomplish something in the future. For those involved, it's helping them become leaders and mentors. To me, I, I just, I'm, I'm here to set the tone and set the example for the younger generation. And though some days the work can be grueling, Philip Miller says he wishes there were more opportunities just like it. We'll have less teenagers getting killed and getting involved with, a, with violence. Cleaning up the streets instead of being on them. In Price Hill, Marielle Carbone, 9 on your side.